Well, this summer, 1,000 young African leaders came to study in the United States uh, through U.S. President Barack Obama's Mandela Washington Fellowship Program. One of these young leaders was Afu Al Fuseni Sidibe is a native of Mali. His mission is to empower Mali's youth through the power of public speaking. VOS Pondio has his story. After being rejected two years in a row, Alpha Suni Sidebe was finally selected as one of the 1,000 participants in the Mandela Washington Fellowship. The fellows represent nearly 50 countries in sub Saharan Africa. In 2016, Sidibe founded Live Your Dream, a grassroots community development enterprise inspired by Toastmasters International. The foundation of any development is young people. So I said to myself, we need to start something. And I said, OK, let's start on this organization, which name is Live Your Dream, because I believe each and every one of us has a dream. And we are helping them to realize this dream. The 29-year-old Malian started this organization in his hometown in Bandiala to focus on youth empowerment, entrepreneurship, public speaking, civic engagement, and business mentoring programs. What inspires you? Once I see myself able to add value to another person, helping him to find his own voice, helping him to find his own way, this is what makes me happy. And actually, reason why I'm still fired up to continue and helping them to continue to help them to grow because I also received from other people. The African Union considers a youth as a unique resource that requires special attention because they constitute up to 65% of the population. Sidibe says young people in Mali are a formidable creative resource that can be harnessed for the country's socio-economic development. We say Young people are the future of tomorrow. They are the future of a nation. But I say the future starts today. I believe that we Africans, we will make change. And this change starts from now. Finding opportunities for young people is a critical challenge for Mali. But Sidibe says that there are possibilities in farming and that young people should embrace going into agriculture as a profession. We see agriculture as an engine to change Africa. Because if we provide enough food, if we can, I'm not saying to stop importing food, but if we can produce food that can compete with the one which is imported and show to the people the benefit of eating locally, mm. encouraging local consumption, encouraging local production, this is how we can get ad Africa out of the poverty. Most exciting perhaps is that Alpha Sene plans to continue empowering the youth uh, innovative programs on entrepreneurship to tackle Mali's high unemployment rate among youth aged 15 to 35. CDB also has his sights set on elsewhere in West Africa where he's already in talks with the administrators of other important youth initiatives to start a Live Your Dream satellite programs. Paul Ndiho, BOA News, Washington.